everyone. It's Chris Paxson here from No Trash, Just Truth Podcast. On Monday, we started a new podcast series called Sin Filled Nation. If you haven't listened yet, what you've missed out on is teaching from the first part of the book of Judges. At this point in the history of the Israelites, they've been led into Canaan after wandering in the desert for 40 years. But things aren't going so well for them. The Israelites have not totally annihilated or driven out the people dwelling in the land as God had instructed them to. This was God's righteous judgment on the Canaanites for their gross sin and their idolatry. Archaeology gives some hints about what the Canaanites were like. On one high place, archaeologists found several stone pillars and a whole lot of jars containing the remains of newborn babies. When a new house was built, a child would be sacrificed and its body built into the wall to bring good luck to the rest of the family. Firstborn children were often sacrificed to Moloch, a giant hollow bronze image in which the fire was built and parents placed their children in the red hot hands and their babies would roll down into the fire. The sacrifice was invalid if a parent displayed grief. Mothers were supposed to dance and to sing. The Israelites later adopted some of these practices. This seems really horrible, but is our culture today much better? Join Rose and I as we take a look at this question and find out what else happens in the first part of the book of Judges on the downhill slide, part one of our series, Sin-Filled Nation. Have a blessed day, everybody.